single time I hear it. Yeah, me too. I'm thinking actually after watching that video a lot and, and listening to that song a lot that I should invest in some 1975 leather trousers. What do you reckon, Fee? Yeah. Do you reckon I can do yeah. it? What do you reckon, Cheryl? I don't think so. Why? No. You wear leather trousers. I know, but I don't think you should. <laughs> well, thanks for joining us, Cheryl. It was lovely to see you, <laughs> and we'll see you. <laughs> Cheryl Fernandez, the seniors here. Good morning. 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 How you doing? I'm um, all right. <laughs> Come on. What, what's wrong with you? I'm a little bit of hungover. A little bit hungover. I'm a little bit hungover. I know. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. I don't even know if I am. I don't know if I'm just tired. I think it's a mixture. Yeah. We've what, had a long week, haven't we? We have. What did you? What was your drink of choice last night? I was drinking red wine, which felt like a good idea at the mm -hmm. time. And I thought it might help us sleep properly. <laughs> <laughs> and then about four hours in, I was like, oh, I've got to get up. Yay. Yay. I mean, you shouldn't be drinking it this time in the morning as well. No. Like, there's no need to be having a big glass of red. Now it's quarter past nine. <laughs> See, I last night drank something that I've never drunk before in my life. Yeah. Never, ever in my life. Which is a vodka, vodka, is martini. it a vodka, vodka martini? Yeah, I started you off on that though at the hotel, didn't I? Yeah. Did you just keep rolling with it? Yeah. So is that is it just vodka? It's kind of just raw vodka, yeah. So like yeah, just I, a splash of whatever you taste. Yeah. yeah. I mean, at the time, people were advising me. Who's the, who? Which people? <laughs> Let's out these people. <laughs> I can't say because it, it sounds like a lie. <laughs> I know who it was. <laughs> I know it was. It was the lady herself, wasn't it? Lady Gaga's advice. <laughs> Well, Lady Gaga, why would thought, you? Why would you take her advice and believe? Because, because I thought she said if I just drink that, I won't be hungover for the radio. Yeah, she's probably having a laugh at us. This <laughs> she's like laying in a castle somewhere in bed watching yeah. the telly, like. <laughs> <laughs> um, but it was fun last night, right? It really was. You were great, actually. So it was the British Fashion Awards you? last yeah. night, and we had to. Well, we went. We went together. Yeah, we did. You were my date. How's your date? I put the picture up on Instagram saying um, me and my date Cheryl, and people are like, "Are they dating?" I'm like newsflash. <laughs> newsflash. <laughs> um, so no, um, she wishes. Um, but we went there last night, and then I had to do a bit of presenting. Was it all right? You were great. It's quite scary that room. But you didn't. You weren't like a lot of people seemed a bit nervous or like emotional, which mm -hmm. is fair enough if you're receiving in an award mm -hmm. or whatever but you were like you know you were good you were ungrateful Thanks, you babe. didn't even look like you were reading from a teleprompter i was really proud apart from when i said i'm reading this apart from when you then <laughs> announced to the room that well, you were because i didn't want people to think that i was like, <laughs> unnecessarily excited about the world of accessories <laughs> no but you were really good I don't sound surprised it's my i job. was convinced <laughs> thanks thank you cheryl um we should talk about the weekend yes um how was it for you did you have a nice time love and heartbreak week well um, the Saturday was a bit of a shock, wasn't it? It really was. Yeah, I didn't know that was happening until no, Friday. Yeah, it's exactly Friday afternoon. It's like a bombshell. Um, so that was a bit like, oh, God. And then you kind of felt like the weekend was done because normally the eviction's on the mm -hmm. Sunday and then you realise, no, actually, we've got another one. Yeah. Sunday And it's saying off. Yeah. And it's kind of a weird vibe. I don't really like it. Oh, no offence to our bosses, nights. but I don't really like a Sunday. I don't like a Sunday. Because it, it, no matter who goes, it does feel... It does feel a little bit sad, doesn't it? Yeah. And Saturday feels like a celebration, exactly. I always think. So it was a bit of a shocker, Mason, going on Saturday, because it changed the vibe a little bit. Definitely. And then it definitely felt different on the Sunday, then. Yeah. It really did, didn't it? Yeah. Can we just not do the Sundays, and can everyone I've just win? every time I've done it, and apparently we have to be there. <laughs> <laughs> have you actually asked? I've asked. <laughs> Like, can't we just let the public decide? This <laughs> and we just, we just watch in. from home. Yeah, we just watch it on the telly. Yeah. I think it'd be nice if just it's a competition, but then no one wins and no one goes home. Yeah. And it's just endlessly on. Exactly. And it's just nice people singing. <laughs> yeah, that would be nice. And there's no it? edge. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whatsoever. Um, Have you spoke to Simon since the weekend? No. Have te you? Well, I've texted him. He's not texted me back. Did he still not text you back? Still not text me back. Ooh. That's 12 hours He's now. jelly because he hasn't got any acts left. Well, he can go to Barbados now, can't yeah, he? Yeah, you can go early. Yeah, Wait, go. <laughs> you mean, Rita, I can just do the rest yeah, of Yeah, we'll do it. And he can go on his uh, yeah. jet ski and have a fag in Barbados. Exactly. Otherwise, he starts poking his nose into our business. Yeah, I'm going to need you. I'm going to need, need you, you to, really to really tell me who fourth impact are oh, as individuals. I need their identity. And why do you need that, please? Could you please explain? yourself carl because i yeah. don't understand yeah. what I'm you're talking about <laughs> i'm going to need you carl to shut the 
Oh. <laughs> I didn't swear. There, that's Big uh, Boss Ben Cooper, then. You nearly swore in front of out there, I did, look. I didn't swear. Ne nearly. Big Boss Ben's there, look. I'm sorry, Big Boss Ben. Big, sorry, Big Boss Ben. There sorry, was Big no Boss swearing. Ben. Sorry, I'm nearly. Promise. She edited. She's a professional, look. <laughs> professional. Um, I've got a question for you. I don't know if you know the answer to it. How does Simon Cowell drive a jet ski and smoke a fag? Because how do you drive a jet ski? Well, it must one get hand? wet. Well, a cigarette must get wet, too. No? I know. I don't know. It's quite a skill. It's, it is a sk I hate jet skis. What do you mean? I can't do it. I don't like bouncing around like that. It's, <laughs> awful. it's not nice, is it? Yeah, it is it's nice. Not for me. Not for me. Not for me. <laughs> I, and it's even worse. It's, it's, a, it's even worse when it goes slow. <laughs> I was trying it once, right? And they were like, no, you need to like speed up. And I was going that way, <laughs> left, right, like reversing everything but what I was supposed to be doing. And slow is even worse. <laughs> so I couldn't win. I was like, I want off. I want off. I want to go back to the show. I'm just not into it. You're not into it. I'm not mad about the ocean in general. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. Like, you don't know what's un in there? Fifi, clip that up. That's my new soundbite. I'm not mad about the ocean in general. We went on the monoliday, right? And uh, Amy was on holiday with us. Yeah. She's our friend Amy. And we went on one and we were like driving it proper fast and like really oh. into it. And my friend Pix went on it with her boyfriend and her boyfriend's like super fun and wanted to drive the jet ski. And she's like, go slowly, George. <laughs> so he just had to do it slowly at like literally like three miles per hour. That's what I was. I think I got up to 10. <laughs> that is not the point. It's meant yeah, to be fun. And then the kind of the waves take over the machine. It's awful. <laughs> it's awful. Have you been on one of the uh, Swagway thing? Have you had to go on that? Yeah, with you. Oh, of course. Yeah, it lift, that... lift me off because I could not find a balance. Oh, you don't like that either? I was rocking, like... She's not a thrill seeker, I she? I'm really not. I'm not a thrill seeker, no. No, no, no. no. I'm the one eating the candy floss waving at the roller coaster. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not on that roller coaster. I love your coat. You get on. You I feel on. like my life's more like a roller coaster. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> don't need to add any more. <laughs> don't need any more thrills. No. So, no. Um, your group's here. Well, they're on their way, they're stuck in the horrible truck. No, they are not. Yeah. Oh, my God. So they should be here, though, like, any minute. Can I just check? My category weren't late, were they, Vic? Because they were professional drummer, they all came in, Sean and me. Don't and worry, I'm, I'm going to have a word with, one, the traffic people. <laughs> and the two, traffic people? Yeah, the production crew, yeah, because yeah. clearly there's favouritism going on here, and I'm not accepting it. So. <laughs> There will be words, Ian Hard. There will be words. Uh, right, roll. track of the day today on Radio 1. This is L King, X's and O's. L King, X's and O's on BBC Radio 1. That is our track of the day. I would love to say a comment on it, but Cheryl talks all the way through it. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that. But Vic just said to me, we need some structure. Okay. okay. What would you like? What would you like? Am I being distracted? Um... A little, but it's only Christmas. Oh, I'm sorry. Sorry. Sorry, sorry. Get back to it. Strict and she's she's like I think she's Simon Cowler. Uh -huh. <laughs> um, by the way, Cheryl on Grimmy is the number one trending topic in the UK. Yeah. Yes. Go us. Go us. <laughs> <laughs> People love us. Um, no, that is uh, all the questions. If you want to ask Cheryl anything, um, then use the hashtag Cheryl on Grimmy. Joanna's been on just with a quote. I'll be having words with the traffic people. <laughs> 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 and then the laughing emoji. <laughs> um, morning to the person that's texting no name because they are sneakily watching right now on the Radio 1 website while they're at their desk. Um, I say, I'm watching Cheryl at my desk, sneakily. And as I really, really love her, please ask her, where's a jumper from? <laughs> it's from Joseph. Joseph. Is yeah, he, it's yeah. a two-piece, it's a, it's a knitted... Uh, jump on match and scoot. Oh, wonderful. For this wonderful weather. Yeah, gorgeous. I like that that's the question out of everything in the world. <laughs> Where's Jumper from? <laughs> Hello. Um, right, let's get some of these going on. Um, a lot of people are green, by the way, on um, on the jet ski front. Yeah. People aren't into them. Into um, them. Let me get these questions. Oh, here's a good one for you. Um, do you know Pop Justice? Yeah. Pop Justice has been on with it's a great Peter, question. Isn't it? Yeah, pizza, yeah. Hey, uh, Peter. I have pizza. He's been on to ask a question. Have you ever fell in a hole? Have I ever fell in a hole? He asked it to Justin Bieber as well the other day. I feel like he wants us to. <laughs> <laughs> I've dodged a manhole before, though. Have you really? Yeah, like, what? just about. What happened? Well, I wasn't looking where I was going. <laughs> <laughs> My friend was like, there's a big hole in the floor. Oh, watch out. Um, she Kate just let us fall down. What she let you go in. Uh, Kate says, what's your, what's your most favourite thing about working with your groups? 
Do you know what, by the way, I, I was spying on you yesterday, working with them. I knew you were. I was looking through the through the glass, watching you. Yeah. And you, you get proper involved. Yeah, we do. We, we like vibe. It takes a while to get a, a nice vibe going. And then I get a little bit too excited and I start saying, let's mix Beanie Man with like um, Maxine and then into certain people. The music team are looking at us like, you three are crazy. And me, Reggie and Bowley are like jumping around the yeah, studio. Yeah, I, I saw it yesterday. I was going to come in and then the dancing you was so good. You wanted to come in and dance I with know, us, right? I know, but the dancing was good, so I, didn't, I was intimidated by the, how good it was. Are we allowed to say what we were dancing to or do you not know? Because it was the song that the public chose. Oh, yeah, yeah, well, yeah, we can talk about that, yeah. Because I talked about Che doing Adele and stuff, yeah. Okay, so yeah. so the public have chose for Reggie and Bowley to do um, Whip Nene. <gasps> so we no, were Whip, whip Nene. Whip. Hey, no, watch me, Nene. Nene. Hey, I know she... what I love. What? Ooh, ooh, watch me. Ooh, ooh, ooh watch, watch me. me. I like do the stanky leg. Do the, the stanky, stanky leg. leg. I like that. Bit yeah. of that. And then you just can't not dance to that. Exactly. You really, really can't. And but what, what, what do you love about working with them? Because they're, they're they're so fun, aren't they? They are literally sunshine. Like mm -hmm. it was raining yesterday when we arrived at the place, and I saw those two, and it just all went out the window. Their smile. Mm -hmm. They're just so grateful and really happy lovely. and humble, yeah. Yeah, they're, they're so... And they're they're everything. In, they're exactly like you see on the telly. Yeah. Like when you see them in the kitchen or in the corridors, yeah. they're always... They're, they're so fun. I really, really love them. Um, Neelam says, um, would Cheryl collaborate with Reggie and Bolly if slash when they make the final? I like the slash when. I love that. Confidence. Hi, Neelam. Um, watch this face. <gasps> I would love to azonto with oh them. Oh my god. Oh yeah. Azonto, 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 azonto. Oh. Please, that would be sick. But please get them through to the final and then I shall. Well, we'll see on Sunday. Mm. If I'm feeling it, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to duet with Che if he's in the final. Do you want him to win or. Here's Florence and the Machine on BBC Radio 1. Holding on to your coat. About your lighting. <laughs> Which bit you are, Kim Kardashian? <laughs> yeah. Do you know what? Uh, Florence, Florence is the machine there and Delilah on BBC Radio 1. Cheryl's here. Hi. What's going on over there? I don't know. Everything and not everything and nothing. <laughs> I'm a mess. I'm a hot mess. You're not a hot mess. I feel hot. It's hot in this room. Is it? Mm. Thank you. We have this argument every single day. Um, right, we have your groups here. Reggie, Re Reggie and Molly are here, and they are going to join us on the show in a second. Tina, who does the news, yeah. is obsessed with them. Do you know how many people came up to me last night? Suits and ties, like proper... British I fashion awards. I really want Reggie and Bowley in the final. I would love that. People I was like, so would I. People love them. People absolutely love them. Uh, well, they're going to be here on the Radio 1 Breakfast Show very, very soon. If you want to ask them anything, uh, then give us a shout, 81199, or our hashtag is Cheryl on Grimmy. Maybe they could ask questions about what Cheryl's like really like to go to work with. Things yeah. like that, yeah. So send those questions in. <laughs> Reggie and Polly join us on the Radio on Breakfast show, but right now it's 9.32. Let's get the latest from Newsbeat with Tina Dahili. <laughs> Selena Gomez on BBC Radio 1. Morning, everybody. Trust me, trust me, trust me. Guess who's in the building? Reggie and Bowie. Good, good, good. Lovely day. We finally made it here. You finally made it. How yeah. long have you been in the car? <laughs> Almost two hours. Wow. <laughs> yeah. We're like, oh, oh God, we don't want to miss this opportunity. And yeah. have you been trapped if you had to listen to me for two hours? We love it. We, we love sorry. listening to you, though. We love, we love listening oh, to good. you. Oh, good. Well, I love seeing you guys. Oh, oh thank oh, you. Nice. Thank you. You can say that on Saturday. I, I do. I'm obsessed with them. <laughs> I mean, have you, have you had a bad comment yet? No. <laughs> Please don't give us one. <laughs> I really want. You know, I saw you after you did um after you did uh the uh, it was the week after you'd done the One Direction song. Yeah. yeah. And I saw you and you said, oh. 
please spare us. <laughs> but it's so fun. Like, it's so, so fun. How do you get that energy? How are you, like, so up and happy all the time? Um, I think the, the reason is because we've, we've wanted this opportunity for a long time. So having it come to us in, like, multiple folds has just made us so happy. Since we've been on this show, I don't think we've ever been sad. You know? Yeah, Aww. yeah. It's like much more than we expected. Yeah. And what about working with Madam? Oh, she's amazing. Yeah. The most wonderful person we've met. Oh, and yeah. it's like she's taking us like brothers and you know we love her oh, we love her too yeah. like we can't describe the way we love her but we love her she's, oh. our, she's our boss you know she's yeah, our, yeah. Know, by the way by the way when those songs from when we were just playing selena gomez they came in reggie bully and they said hi boss morning boss <laughs> did you, did the, does she make you call her boss no no we, we love to yeah, call her boss <laughs> i secretly love her though. do you like it yeah. Yeah, yeah like when we're doing rehearsals and i go get them legs up boys yeah. they're like yes boss <laughs> <laughs> yes, boss. Um, what's the best thing about working with Cheryl, Reggie? You know what? Working with Cheryl is just so, so much fun. Because we call, anytime we meet her, we call it the vibing session. Right? Yeah. The vibing yeah. session. Yeah. 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 And you should be with us to see the type of song Cheryl makes us listen to. <laughs> wow, I didn't know she listened to that. All right, then. Can you listen to this one, boss? And then, like, it's just so much fun. And the thing is, she's much more than we expected. Yeah. So, like coming down to our level and sometimes we're talking and the two of us watch it like it's her <laughs> yeah. it's great. don't you just love her yeah. I love that and the fact that she allows us to bring our opinions on board yeah without we don't have no fear working with her there's no pressure we feel like yeah let's say what we want and she will advise us like okay this is what i think let's do this so uh -huh. we work together so it's amazing we love her is there anything bad like what's your negative let's try and think come on like I'll let me i'll try and think of something <laughs> as well. like let, what what don't we like about cheryl there's uh, loads of things not you i don't think there's we're all day if it's you <laughs> <laughs> i don't think there's something we don't like about her sometimes i feel maybe we we just worry her too much, you know. Yeah. Cause I, and anytime we call her, maybe we are not too sure about the song. Literally within thirty minutes to one hour, she will come and we feel like we don't want her to feel like we're we, taking advantage. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The, yeah. I, oh, I've thought of something that's bad about you. Cool. See if you two have noticed this. How slowly does she walk? I've only got little legs. She, have, you, have you noticed how slow she walks? I'm a size no. three. You're a size ten or something. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like Nicholas Wayne. <laughs> Is, even if she walks slow, we would enjoy it, you know, because the, the longer we spend with her, oh. maybe that's why she does it. So she doesn't. Do it. That's the only bad thing I can. Do. That's an all right thing. Uh, right, questions. Holly's been on. Um, Cheryl, what do you think it is about Reggie and Bolly that have made the public fall in love with them? Because people everywhere I go, and I'm sure it happens to you more yeah. than me, but the, everyone loves them. Yeah. Right, from kids to mothers yeah. to grandmas, is like they're crossing over massively. I think because initially people were like, you know, it was the controversial choice, if you like, and slowly but surely they've seen them for what they are, mm -hmm. and you can't deny their presence. I mean, you felt that energy in this in the literally room. the first one we loved it, didn't we? Seriously, it just yeah, goes it's off. energy, and they're just gorgeous, like inside out. Everything about them's pure. Everything about them's humble. Nice, you know, it's just everything. They're uh, talented. I, I can't say enough about them. Oh, thank you, thank you so oh, much. God, everyone loves them. Yes, boss. Yes, boss. Yes, thank you, yes, boss. boss. Yes, boss. Thanks, boss. Um, <laughs> and and we, we, we've talked a little bit about already before you guys came in about what you're going to do on Saturday. Yeah. yeah. I'm so excited. For that. <laughs> yeah. I really, really am excited. Do you know where it's going in the show yet? Do you know where? You, what, what? What? Are you like starting it? Are you ending it? Do you know? We don't know. No, we don't, don't know, know yet. yet. Yeah. 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 Well, wherever it is, <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm really looking forward to it. We can't wait. We can't yeah. wait. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Really and you know they do two songs this week yeah, for the two. contestants, yeah? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. So one from the public that's already been chosen, and then we have to choose one. Mm -hmm. Have you chosen? Uh, kind of. We, we worked on a rough thing. Yeah. 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 <laughs> See, I, I, well, the public picked Hello for, for Che Che. Oh, um, I know. Wow. Yeah. Oh, wow. goodness. It's only an Adele song. <laughs> wow. I know. Oh, and by the way, like, Che is so, like, it's so funny because he's, like, 
you know what, then? Yeah, I'll give it a go. All right, then. And then he just sings it exactly like Adele. And he's like, well, yeah, it's all right. I'm like, it's not all right. It's amazing. It's amazing. You know, I always tell him, like, before we go on, sometimes he comes in and he's like, oh, guys, I'm on voice rest. And I'm like, stop it, Jay. He always comes in voice rest and then gets on the stage and boom, like, let's <laughs> the off, like. <laughs> It's working for him. I yeah. saw um, Jonathan Saunders last night and he said, Reggie and Bowley get two votes. Uh -huh. Both in back get two votes, and his other vote goes to Chi. Does it? Yeah. <laughs> I'll take that, I'll right? take that. Thanks, Jonathan. Thanks, Jonathan. Uh, well, Reggie and Bowley, I never want to say bye to you ever, but we have to because we have oh. to get fourth impact oh, no. in. Oh, oh no. That's what has to happen. Can we talk some more? And bring, uh, can we all talk? Well, should we get them all in? Yeah. We've not got enough microphones. <laughs> <laughs> Where are they going to go and sit out there? No, they can just hang out here. Oh, okay, so that's okay. I'm not kicking them out in the street. Okay, fine. <laughs> <laughs> um, guys, it was great to see you. Thank you for coming in, and can't wait to see you on Saturday. Uh, uh, thanks so thank much, Nick, for having a big yeah. shout-out to our friends and colleagues at Wex Stelges and everyone. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> thank you, Reggie. Thanks, Polly. Yeah, thanks. thank you. Everyone out there who's been voting for us, thank you so much for the love. We really appreciate it. That's what's up. Oh, that's <laughs> what's up. That's right. They're rehearsing for the flurry. Good everybody. It's BBC Radio 1. It's Nick Grimm's show with you on the Radio 1 Breakfast Show. And Cheryl is still here. Yeah. I, I am. I am, Pet. I'm staying till the end. Are you actually? Yeah. Well, we've only got six minutes left, so. Um, <laughs> do you want to um, do it tomorrow with me? Wake up early? Uh, I think I've got something to do, actually. Oh, sure. Do you want to introduce these here? It's Four Little Dollies, Four Them Bags. Yeah! Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. How are you? We're good. good. Nice We're to still see small. You. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for having us. Hey, thank you for coming in because I know it's early, but I mean, your life thank must you. be so crazy right now and so busy. How are you dealing with the schedule? Because it's not just turning up on Saturday and singing, is it? It's all week. Yes. 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 We're How's enjoying everything. Yes. Yeah. We're yeah. just enjoying everything. And and so this far, and you know, this is such a um, dream come true for us, and we just can't believe until now that we're here because huge stars are just you know, standing right here, and now... And now you guys are here. <laughs> hey, talking about the, the star thing and it all happening, um, with their photographers outside Radio 1 this morning. Yes. yes! We were so shocked when we go down to, from the taxi, all the paparazzi were, were coming in, and we're like, oh my God, folks, folks, folks! <laughs> and we she... forgot that we're late. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> You've actually been here for an hour. You've just been downstairs <laughs> having pictures taken. Has Cheryl taught you any tips on like how to pose and how to have your picture taken, or, or, or have you got that already? They're giving me tips. I was gonna say. I, I, I think you've already got that. You've already yeah, got that. Got it in the bag. Yeah. Um, how have you been enjoying the show so far? We are so enjoying it. I mean, since the first audition until now, and. We just enjoy everything. Yeah. We never get tired of like practicing and sh filming and everything. And with our mentor, she's so kind to us. She's the sweetest mentor that we can have. And Unless you had me, of course. <laughs> <laughs> we are just so blessed that this is all happening to us right yeah. now. We just can't believe that everything is happening. We just literally talk about, you know, the fact that... UK accepted us as such a prize for us, and we we it's really big honor that. for us. Thank oh, you very well, we much. love having you on the show. Thank so you. So entertaining <laughs> every week. What's been your What's been your favorite performance that you've done so far? Oh, mine or theirs? Mm, you pick theirs first. Go on, you go first. I think <laughs> not. I think the week Selena had a little turn, um, but it worked it out. Work it out. Oh, work it out was amazing. Because yeah. we spoke about that in the week. Yeah, and I, well, told, I said to Cheryl, shimmy. I was like, oh, that is a tune. Yeah. I love that song. <laughs> I think that was my favourite. I think that was oh. my yeah. favourite. That was really That was our favourite also. Is it yeah. yours? Work it out. Yeah, yeah there we great. go. There we go. We're all yeah. on the same page. <laughs> and, then, and then now, right, it's getting quite serious on the show. Because yeah. everyone's good. Like, yes. So no one really deserves to go home at all. And do you feel like now like the competition is on? I do. Yeah, we really felt that from the beginning, and now that we're here, it's As top five. We, we just said that we just surrender it to God. We would just do everything, and we just enjoy everything because everyone's dreaming about it, and we're leaving it, and we're not gonna let any little chance to let go of anything. So uh -huh. we would just rehearse, rehearse, and then surrender everything to God. Oh, <laughs> you're prepared for this. And then what are you doing at the weekend? What's the song? Can we can we say? And the song from the public uh -huh. is um, "I'll Be There." 
What's that? I'll be there. Uh, be we're going to do a ballet oh this week. Yes. From the Jackson Five oh, wow. to the Filipino Four. Oh, <laughs> they fall the Filipino Queens. Oh. Well, I look forward to that. That's going to be great. And Thank girls, you. good luck for Saturday. Thank you very so much. And you're, you're going to do a gig right now. Yes, yes, we're going to the Philippine Embassy to wow. sing for some Filipino communities. Yes. Yeah. Oh, wicked. Well, have a great gig today. Thank you so, Thank you so much. much. And I'll see you. Thank at... you for having us. Oh, you're so welcome. Anytime. <laughs> and I'll see you on Friday. Yes. yes. Okay, we'll Thank see you then. You. And Thank, Thank you. you, girls. Thank Salam. you. Thank you, everyone. Bye, girls. <laughs> and thank you, Cheryl, as well. Thank you for coming That's in. Sweet. Have you had a nice time? I have. I same time, same place tomorrow morning? Yeah? Uh, yeah, yeah. I'll be in 6 bed. 6.30. Yeah, I'll yeah. see you tomorrow morning. <laughs> um, we're going to end with this. I love this. Brand new stuff from Disclosure and Lord uh, from the album Caracal. Uh, this is Magnets on Radio 1. Never really felt bad about it. As we drank deep from the light. Stuff from Disclosure and Lord, that is Magnets. Love that record from the album, like I said, Caracal, which is really, really great. Have you got into that album? I haven't listened to it yet. You need no. to get into I it. I love good. this track, though. It's great, right? Yeah. It's really good. <laughs> um, <laughs> right, we, we're done now. It's 10 o'clock. We've had oh. quite the show this morning. Um, we spoke to Fleur this yeah. morning. Fleur East going to be in the Life Lounge uh, taking over in a minute. Uh, so we had a lovely chat with Fleur. We spoke to Annie Nightingale. Uh, she, I know. She was so cool. Isn't she cool? Yeah. She's great, isn't she? She is. So she, you know, she's the first ever female DJ on Radio 1. I didn't know that, no. Was it 1969? 1969. She's amazing. So she's been doing, uh, been in the music industry for 50 years. And tonight there's a special documentary on Radio 1, 9 o'clock, me and her sit down. We talk about everything. I'm going to watch it. So on the 7 is, we talk about Acid House, Grime. Oh, she put, wow. She put the first rave on in Chile. Oh, I love her. <laughs> <laughs> I love her. She's got some right good stories. Um, and, of course, we had Anna and Deck, and we've had Cheryl, and we've had Fourth Impact, and we've had Reggie and Bolly. Yeah, and Deck just tweeted us, actually. What they said? Telling me to do an impression of uh, Vicky from George. <laughs> have you been watching the show? Yeah, I love it. I, I'm obsessed with it. And I've got it on catch up so that when I miss one, yeah. I catch up. Yeah. <laughs> so, that's the exclusive, guys. She's and got it on catch up, it so she misses it. That's she can catch up. on four hours. She can leave us alone. So they said to do an impression of Vicky. Go Should on, I do one? Yeah, come on, let's hear your Vicky impression. I don't know what that lady says on. Like, what's the matter with her leg like, pet? <laughs> <laughs> That's just you. <laughs> no. <laughs> No. no, 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 no. Um, morning, Clara Ramsay. Hello. Morning, Hi, Clara. Clara. It's all happening, isn't it? It really, really is. Um, by the way, my mum is really excited by Reggie and Bolly. Yeah. Uh, so I'm from Ghana as well, you see, so she's just like, oh, my God. Oh, so I'm Ghana, Ghana love. There you go. I love them. She'll be voting every week. So. Yeah. I love them. Yeah. But also vote for Che. Yeah, of course. Of course, of course, of course. Yeah? Yeah. Cheryl? Uh, yeah? He said he's going to sing with him in the final, so make up your own mind. Oh, I am. Me and Che exactly. at the final. <laughs> Hello from the other side. Um, Are you yeah, sure? I think you should be the outside lane. Yeah. You should be outside of that. Outside the arena. Yeah. yeah, held down by security. Yeah. Uh,